Okay. So today, oh, that's all his balls. Today, I woke up sad. Today I woke up depressed, which was weird. It was weird. Like it's weird how some days you just wake up and you feel it, and you're like, today, today is not my day. <laughs> yeah, it wasn't my day. It's actually not been my day the past two days, which is weird. Because there's a lot of good things happening in my life. But I have a really hard time seeing the positive. Which is also weird because I talk about seeing the positive a lot. I'm not trying to be hypocritical. I just have trouble too. So I asked why are we sitting down and we're gonna chat. We're just gonna, we're just gonna, we're just gonna chill. And I mean, I'm boiling right now and I decided to hit the hot chocolate. Ah, which is boiling. I don't know why I keep sipping it. So I saw my friend, I don't know if my, no, it's not my friend. She's more of like an acquaintance. I would love to be her friend, but I don't know if she's... My friend, Dodie, I uh, did a panel with her at Playlist. We've met a few times. We're nice people, we say hi. She made a video called I Am Depressed Today and I thought it was amazing. I thought it was so, so real. And I've been finding myself watching these type of videos um, a lot recently be be because I've been waking up in this mood. And it's super weird. It's helped, it's helped me a lot, it's helped me a lot. Knowing that other people are going through it too really helps me and I think that's why you guys watch this channel. And I think that, that that's the main reason why I wanted to make a video. I just wanted to sit down and talk because I was having a really hard time thinking about like what to film. Not that it matters anyways. I don't really have a schedule anymore. <sighs> oh, it's better now. I have this problem where if I'm successful, I always find a way to bring myself down because I don't think I should have that high of expectations in my life. Like a really, really good thing happened to me last week. A massive thing. Out of this world, I can't tell you what it is. I'm not trying to be that YouTuber who's saying that this thing is happening, but I can't tell you because I don't even know what's happening yet. But like this huge thing happened and I can't seem to like it anymore. I can't seem to enjoy the idea of it and it stresses me out and I think negatively. It's a problem, I know. Another thing that's kind of positive is that I've been working out a lot recently, and if you follow me on Instagram, not saying, actually, you should probably go follow me on Instagram. It's at Joey Kidney. It looks like this. It's really cool. I love talking to you guys on there. And uh, I've been working out a lot recently just because I wanted to get my body into a shape where, you know, I, I like it. And that's, that's literally the, the only reason why I'm doing it. And I find I'm very hard on myself at the same time. Like, I'm like, oh, I don't have like the pecs of this guy. And I think like a lot, a lot, there's a lot of stigma in men's health. We always look at that cover or we look at that Instagram picture where we're like, wow, we want to be that guy. I want to be that big, you know, or small, whatever you want in life. And it's really been stressing me out lately, but like it's a good thing. <laughs> I don't know when to stop. Another thing that I've been kind of going about lately, and I haven't really told the main channel this, I got into school again, which is really cool. Yeah, I got into like a really cool program. Uh, it's kind of my, like my dream program right now for school, and I don't know if I want to go. Not because I don't like the school. I mean, I've already graduated from college, if you don't already know, but it's just like, I don't know if I want to go back. Is that taking a step back? I know education. Like, see, my problem is, my pro this is my problem. I know everything. I know the, the reason why we feel things and everything like that, and why I'm feeling the way I do, and there's like pros and cons to everything. I, and I, I get both sides of like, why I shouldn't go and why I should go, but I'm like, I have a really hard <laughs> time figuring out what the middle is. Um, I'm not asking for you to help me. But like, I don't know, if you relate to this, comment down below. Yeah, so I'm really stre I'm stressing about school. Everyone's like, go, go, go. And I'm like, but what is it? Wh but what if I'm putting a hold of my career? What if I'm taking a step backwards? What if I get this, this crazy opportunity and I'm stuck in school? And then the other side of me is thinking like, well, it's just school. You can leave it and do it again. If this opportunity is that amazing, you can just leave school. And so I'm like, okay, I'll go to school. But then the other side comes back with another point and this side comes back with, and it's just this, oh, I don't even know where I wanna go. I don't know, I'll figure it out. I haven't cleaned lately. I'm a big clean person. I spilled hot chocolate, the powder, and I still haven't cleaned it up. And I'm looking at it and it's bugging me, but I probably won't do it until tomorrow. Actually, I'll probably do it tonight. But I, I don't clean anymore because three people, Three people came over to my place and they're like, well, you clean? And I, I felt really insecure. And I'm not trying to be a hypocrite. I, I, I tweeted today and I was like, I hate people who preach things that they don't do. And like, I, I preach about being yourself. But I, I don't know why, but these demons are attacking me being like, whoa, are you clean? Stop cleaning. And I'm like, whoa, I just like to look at my TV without seeing fingerprints. Like who the hell's touching my TV? Who, why are there fingerprints on my TV? I don't get that. <laughs> Where did those come from? The demons. I don't know. I don't know. I'm in this like state 
of I don't know. And if my mother's watching, don't, I'm okay. But I just, I don't, I, I don't, I don't know. I just wanted to sit down and like be in like a fetal position and drink hot chocolate and talk. That's it. I just came back from spin class. I've been spinning lately because my neighbor is a spin instructor and every time I walk in the hallway and I see him, I'm like, damn, because I know he's going to invite me to spin class. And it's like, it's really fun. I think I'm getting okay at it. Like I start like to not die, which is really cool. <laughs> a lot of people are bugging me right now about um, relationships and everything like that. And I'm just like, can we chill? Can we just like take it down here? It's like, it's, 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 yeah, it's a lot. It's a lot right now. <laughs> There's a lot of everything happening. And it's all good stuff. It's all good stuff. And that's the hard part. I don't know how to handle good things. I'm very great. I'm amazing at handling bad things. I am so, I'm so good at handling depressing, horrible moments. Wait, is this one of them? Am I not good at this anymore? God damn it. I think the last thing I want to talk about is I've been seeing like this therapist recently. And I've seen therapists before. Like I've seen them in the past. Um, and they, they've, they've helped me, I think. I, th I think they've helped me. And it's just like talking to a stranger and just saying everything and almost crying and knowing that when you leave that room, that person has nothing to do with you. For some reason, it's comforting. Except I find it really expensive and it's really hard to go out and find a therapist that's right for you. And I recently found like this. This is not a brand deal right now. This is not a brand deal. Everyone be okay. It's not a brand deal. But I found this website um, and I'm gonna, I will, I will tell you guys more about it after I have a few more sessions. I wanna make sure this is something I wanna tell you guys. Um, but I, I've, I've been using this website and it's it's really cool. It's it's cool. It's comforting. It's nice. It's nice to just be able to get help from anywhere in the world. And, and that's an, that's a whole nother thing is that these anxiety videos have been blowing up and it's like, it's really cool. But I'm also like, I'm getting a lot of emails about you guys and I wish I could help every single one of you, but I just don't, I don't have all the answers and it's stressing me out. And so I'm really, I, I am working so hard into finding someone to help you and to finding an organization that is worldwide, that is international and is just ready to help all of you because I can't answer every single email. I can't put myself in a situation like that when I get a positive thing happening to me and I'm going crazy. <laughs> so yeah, that's life. So I'll be telling you guys about that shortly. I'm su I'm super excited. I hope I hope it works out and I hope it goes well. But I think that's it. I think that's all I really want to talk. It feels good to just get off my chest. And it's like these are all things I'm excited for. I'm excited to be working out, going to spin. I'm excited to go to school. I'm excited to even not go to school and have like everything that I'm working on happen. I'm excited for the therapist and sharing this with you guys. I'm excited for this other big opportunity that's happening. And I'm excited for my podcast, which is finally going up um, this Sunday. So if you go down there, I'm gonna try to get it up for this Sunday. But if you guys go down there, and it, it's called Young Dumb and 21, you can follow it on SoundCloud. I'm trying to get it on iTunes right now. Um, that's going up this Sunday, so I'm super, I'm, I'm so excited for that. And then new merch designs I've been working on, just a lot of work, just know I'm super stressed out. <laughs> but that's about it, I'm okay. I, I am, I am truly okay. I just wanna say thank you for all the support. And uh, I'll see you guys on Instagram and in the comments down below. I'm going to be reading them. And I love when you guys comment. Comment actually your favorite YouTubers. Comment your favorite YouTubers who sit down and have these real talks and like make make, make cool stuff. I, re I would love to see them. I would love to see find new people because I'm so tired of the <laughs> same ones. And I'm so tired of this new era. I want cool people. That's it. I want people like me. I'm cool. Yo, I'm cool. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to stop there. It's too much positivity. But I love you guys very much, and I will see you on Friday, I think, with a new video. But, uh, yeah. Okay, peace. Wait, that's not how I end it. <laughs> stay, stay beautiful, and I'll talk to you guys later.